I felt like it was very difficult for people to take me seriously. I felt like a joke, you know? Selena Gomez is getting real about life after Disney. Everything is not what it seems. Yeah, everything was not what it seems for Cell as she rebranded herself from child star to legit actor. I, I feel like this time I'm, I'm just so confident and comfortable and I feel free more than I've ever felt in my whole life. She opens up about her journey to that place on the Hollywood Reporters Awards Chatter podcast. I'm not going to be one to just be like poor me or woe is me because I have slowly pushed through that and I'm really glad but it was very frustrating. There were moments where I felt like I was I was just like I don't I don't have what it takes to do this. But now Selena says she's only grown from it and is grateful for her past. I am so grateful because everything that I've done, I've earned and I've worked really hard for and I would never replace that for the world. If everything was handed to me, I guarantee you I would be a totally different person. And I've seen that happen in, in people and that's so disheartening. It's something she opened up to ET about in 2012 too, around the time Wizards of Waverly Place wrapped. It's been interesting watching that transition go throughout the years. I mean, there were girls that are my that were my age, 16 when I started, and now they're 19, 20 with me and we kind of grew up together. So in a way, some of my fans have already grown with me and others I'm gaining new fans that are still young. Do you have any regrets yet? I mean, is, are you, do you think you're I too, don't, I too? Don't, I don't like regrets. I don't okay. Like regrets. I mean, I've made mistakes, but I mean, everything happens for a reason. Another thing she doesn't regret, her past relationships. I'm so sick of that same old love. Selena shared hints about her love life in her music, which came up during the THR chat. The star says her breakup with Justin Bieber and the public attention surrounding it only made her stronger. I do know that during that time, I was learning so much about myself. I was, you know, obviously going through a really uh, tough breakup. It was really hard, but you know, being on the other side of it, I have to be honest, it's it's actually, it's actually been really good for me. Um, it allowed me to develop such a character where I don't tolerate any sort of nonsense in any way. And I think I'm really proud of how I've come out of it. And Selena has a lot to be proud of right now. I'm just, I'm, I'm in a really happy place. It's been good. In the last year alone, she nabbed her first Grammy nomination for her EP, Revelation. Um, I cried I'm like a little baby. I was very excited. Um, and I worked really hard on that project. So it was a lovely surprise. Turn the pandemic into a positive, filming three seasons of her hit cooking show, Selena and Chef. It's going to remove this inside like a professional. Like a professional. Look at that. And earned rave reviews for her biggest adult acting project yet on Hulu's Only Murders in the Building. Our lives blow up if we all go down for this. Don't you want to clear your name too? I have to see this through. Season two is on its way. And judging by what Selena and her co-stars, Steve Martin and Martin Short told ET last month, we all better buckle up. More crime, more murder. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's and crime and murder. Yeah. Oh, and murder wow. mixed, hoping... mixed with kind of an element of crime. Death. Yeah. Yes, and oh, death, no, death yeah. permeates. It's also really funny. Yes. <laughs> <That's right. laughs> no, we can't tell you anything. No, it's really honestly going to be great. We want it to be the best one.